I'm Madison Foglio, here with your Just the News Now. Former President Donald Trump is criticizing President Joe Biden's withdrawal from Afghanistan, saying it's inconceivable that anybody could be so incompetent, stupid. In an interview Wednesday on Newsmax, as Greg Kelly reports, Trump also blasted U.S. troops being sent back to Afghanistan to evacuate people. I think our soldiers are in danger, he said. There's never been anything so poorly handled. Trump also said that the Biden administration's handling of the U.S. withdrawal was a result of the 2020 election being rigged. Now, switching gears, new polling shows a majority of Floridians support Republican Governor Ron DeSantis' approach to let parents determine if their children should wear masks in school. The polling conducted by Aristotle Inc. on behalf of Florida Atlantic University's Business and Economics Polling Initiative also found that a majority disapprove of the governor's stance in banning businesses from requiring proof of vaccinations from patrons and employees. And finally, George Mason University has granted a COVID vaccine exemption to law professor Todd Zawicki after he sued the university for refusing to recognize his natural immunity. But the public university, just outside of the nation's capital, says it's not adding recovery from COVID to its list of approved exemptions for the faculty. So Wiki's lawyers said they continue to explore litigation against GMU and other Virginia public universities with similar policies. And that's a wrap for today's Just the News Now. To find the latest headlines, please visit justthenews.com.